Earlier on July 13th, 2021, Delta Airlines in a corporate press release has announced the acquisition of more aircraft. The airline will acquire 36 used aircraft as it continues to streamline and modernize its fleet. The deal will grow Delta's wide body fleet with seven Airbus A350-900 aircraft and its narrow body fleet with an addition of 29 Boeing 737-900 ERs. Deliveries are planned to be completed by quarter one of 2022 and the aircraft will enter service after conformity and modifications are complete. The used Boeing 737-900ERs will be purchased from the low-cost Indonesian carrier Lion Air. The 737-900ER was first delivered to Delta in September 2013. The 180-seat 737-900ER is currently the largest fleet type at Delta with 130 currently in service. Once deliveries of the 29 used aircraft are complete in 2022, there will be a total of 159 900ERs in the fleet. The seven used Airbus A350-900s from LATAM are set to be leased through the leasing company AirCap. These aircraft have only been in service for roughly six years. In May 2021, Delta and LATAM received approval of their joint venture. During this time, Delta absorbed LATAM's order for 10 of the unbuilt A350s. Delta's A350 fleet is currently at 15 in service, with seven more being added to the fleet from LATAM by 2022. They also have an additional 20 on order new from Airbus, 10 of which were originally on order with LATAM. Delta has accelerated the delivery of two of the A350s that are currently on order to the second half of 2022, as opposed to later in the decade when the order was deferred to. Amid the COVID pandemic, Delta retired its Boeing 777 fleet, opting to replace it with the Airbus A350-900, citing the 21% less fuel burn per seat. The A350 first entered service in October 2017 after replacing the aging Boeing 747-400. With its 306-seat cabin, the A350 is currently Delta's largest aircraft. The airline currently plans to have 42 when all the above deliveries are completed.